Hello everyone, and welcome back to the channel. My name is Burke, and this is a little bit of a state of the channel address and just general update on uh, on how I'm feeling. Ooh, a bit of a voice break. How I'm feeling about how things are going at the moment. Um, you may have noticed that the channel has changed names. Uh, I previously was Burke the Redneck Viking, and I am now Burke the Gaijin. And that's because I felt like Gaijin is a better identifier to who I am. I was I was born in in Cardiff and then moved to England very young, and I've always felt a little bit out of place, um, even living where I have lived for as long as I have. I should be really feeling like a true local, so to speak. But there's just always been something slightly off. I've always felt like I slightly don't belong. Um, and ultimately, we don't really have a word for that. However, the Japanese do. And, I mean, Gaijin just means foreigner, but it's... It, you know, we have the word foreigner, but I'm not technically a foreigner. But Gaijin is... It, that identifier really is how I feel about my life. I've never felt like I'd fit in. And I never truly felt at home, weirdly, until I went to Tokyo. And I was literally a Gaijin. I felt so comfortable and in, in a place that just felt right. And... That was kind of a turning point in my mentality in my life. And it's kind of what made me really want to start doing this. Really get into creating and actually doing something with 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 what I want to do after ages of, of saying, Oh, I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it. Finally doing it. It, it, it was an inspirational trip. And, that, and that's why I've, I've changed the name of, of the channel. And I feel like it's a better identifier. It's very quick. It's very easy. Should things go very well and I go to events, it's easy to say, ah, Burke the Gaijin, then Burke the Redneck Viking. So, uh, so yeah, that, that's the reason for the name change, and that's why I'm going to be going forward. I will now be Burke the Gaijin. And, uh, and yeah, that's, that's going to wear him out with things. Um, one thing I do want to talk about especially is potentially a change to, to some of the content you'll be seeing in the future. Nothing's going away. I'm going to continue doing what I'm doing um, with gameplay and experimenting with short form, medium form, long form, and seeing what truly settles into a rhythm of of feeling the most comfortable. Um, but I want to start including some live action stuff. I, I've been watching a lot of YouTubers like uh, The Anime Man, uh, C Dog VA, Connor, because C Dog VA is an insane name, uh, and abroad in Japan, and it it it's give me an extreme desire to want to do live action stuff, wanting to to explore around Britain and find weeby stuff for fellow weebs and, and nerds to do is something I really like the sound. Of. So I will be starting to look to incorporate that with some friends of mine like bringing some friends with me to record my good friend Jakob has already said he'd he'd be down for being in the videos um and uh, another friend of mine has said he'd, he'd like to to be the cameraman for stuff so I, I've started to formulate a little bit of a plan and uh and yeah it's something I I would like to really include Re I'd really like to include to add some diversity to what I do and uh to really give a, a more well-rounded sense. It's also why I want to start doing uh, things like anime and manga reviews. Because I've loved anime and manga for years. And I, I, I've i recently been watching Evangelion for the first time. Which is insane to say at my age to only just have started watching Evangelion. And it left me with a number of thoughts. I'm not all the way through it yet, but I've, I've, I've got some thoughts on Evangelion that aren't new, but I kind of want to just get them out into the world. So, 
I want to start including some anime reviews, some like I said, some live action stuff, and uh, and yeah, I'll we'll see how that goes. Um, as of this moment, I'm not too sure when I'm gonna start doing it, but you can rest assured that at some point. There will be some live action stuff on this channel maybe the start of next year potentially at this point but um there will be some live action stuff because i really want to do some live action stuff uh and that includes when i when i go back to japan next year i'm going twice hopefully hopefully i'm gonna record some live action stuff while i'm there and uh i just gonna be in my element be where i want to be and we will uh yeah we'll we'll see how that goes because i would really like to be able to make what i do now a full-time thing i know there are thousands of people in the world that are like oh, i want to i want to do youtube live action i want to do live action i want to do youtube all time i i want to be a youtuber <laughs> but i feel like a lot of them have misunderstood being a youtuber for being a like viral sensation you know in the modern day everyone's hunting the the million the million view video uh, the viral video i don't care about that i don't care about about being i, I don't care about doing like clickbaity stuff and i don't particularly care about doing like making videos specifically for the sake of making a million view video I don't like any of that. It's why I, I've never been into TikTok. I've never really cared about that kind of thing. Um, I only now upload this clip, these clips that you're seeing playing currently. Um, I I used to use it on my, my original TikTok just to look at dumb memes and send my friends memes. Um, I've never particularly cared for, for all that kind of thing. I exclusively care about making cool stuff. I want to make interesting and and fun things that that make me happy. Um, and it's why I want to look at doing live action stuff. I want to start showing places you can go as a dork and a nerd uh, and a weeb in a country that's very anti all that. You know, Britain's not very accommodating of, of weebs, I feel. Um, so I, I want to start trying to show places you can go. And just make a, like a, a little, you know, aim to make a bit of a community focused around that. Focused around just being weird and being different and individual. And that's all I really care about. Um, I I really want to to make a space where people can can bond together over their love of being strange and weird, and not really care about what the world has to say, because that's my favorite thing about all the YouTubers I've ever watched, and all the the creators I've ever watched is it's just been a place. It's been a safe space to, to be different. And that's all I particularly care about. Um, yeah. And it's it, what's nice about what's been happening with the channel is I went from upload... I went I uploaded an entire series, the enti my entire playthrough of... Uh, of... Oh, it's a Ghost of Tsushima. I'm still uploading that. I uploaded my entire playthrough of... Um, Death Stranding to almost no views. And it was kind of a heartbreaking thing of me putting so much time into it for it to get no views. And it, and this is a very minute like experience of that. You know, there are some people that make God, some, some people make like documentary level videos that n almost never see the light of day because they just don't catch fire like they should. Um, 
But it was it was the first moment of going, oh, just because I upload stuff doesn't mean people will watch it. It doesn't mean it's going to get traction automatically. So, since, uh, since I started uploading more things, I've started getting views and it's really nice because I'm only getting like 20 views on things, like 15, 20 views, sometimes below 10. But it's really heartwarming to be like, there are people watching this. Some stuff has like five hours of watch time. And I don't think I, I'm like, I don't deserve this. Why are you watching my, my content? Um, but it's, it's getting views and it's just, it's very rewarding to be like, people are listening. Even if it's a very small number of people, people are seeing what I do and they're liking it and they think it's funny. And it's getting some small amount of attention. And hopefully I can build that attention to create a community of, of like-minded weirdos and, and and weebs. And that's that's really where I want to take this channel. So that that's a little bit of a of a of a game plan over the next year or so to try and start building this channel and start building this this community that I've, I've, I've like set my flag down and said, this will be where we start. So, um, yeah, I hope if you're watching this, you are happy to be part of that community and happy to, to join that family. And, uh, and Hey, if you're watching this and you're not subscribed yet, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And, uh, and share it with people that you think are weird and strange. And tell them, let them know they have a place to go. So, uh, as for me, I think I'm done yapping for now. Um, thanks so much for watching this, if you did. Um, it means a lot for me just to have your time. So thank you. Uh, and I hope wherever you are in the world, you're having a wonderful morning, afternoon, or evening. Or generally, a hell of a day. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.